My name is Steve Martin. I'm president of Martin Industries. Uh, we manufacture the Martin Till product line. Uh, this is the first time at Louisville we have shown our new F Crusher closing wheel. Uh, one thing we've learned from watching Beck's reports and our competition is that no one's closing wheel works across the board. So we, we realize there have been some areas where our long tooth traditional spading closing wheel maybe was not preferred. Uh, this new wheel has a shorter tooth. And more importantly than that, between the teeth, we have this large surface that will press the soil tightly around the seed. So in, in soil types maybe that have uh, higher organic matter uh, that are a little tiltier, I call it, this may be the, the best option. It's priced competitively uh, against the plastic closing wheels. It's cheaper than the poly wheels from other manufacturers and it is ductile cast iron. So we're real excited to, to have this out at Louisville this year and looking forward to hearing from customers uh, after they run this spring. I think a customer that maybe does some vertical tillage, uh, has a little bit of loose soil on top, uh, uh, a soil type that needs crushing from the top down. There's some soil types, like the ones we farm in West Kentucky, that are real dense. They need the spike to break, the long spike to break the sidewalls. Other parts of the country, maybe not. So if, you, if you've if you been running one of the short tooth competitive products, this is a good alternative for long life. It should last for years and years. We have, uh, we still have some supply available, uh, so, but I would expect we're going to sell out in a few weeks, so get your orders in soon if, uh, if you're interested in, in running some of these in your area. One thing that makes this unique is we have a sharper point on one side and a more rounded point on this side. So that two setting at that it has a draft angle on it, so when it's mounted on the planter kind of running like this, that full footprint is touching the ground. So it's also tapered, so as it hits the ground, it's trying to force the soil towards the seed trench. So it's very unique. It's bi-directional. You can flip it around and run it whichever way you want. Uh, if that sharper point towards the seed maybe is too aggressive, you can turn it and put the rounded point towards the seed. So it's very versatile in how it can be installed and run.